Hello once again, Internet. I am Rosanix7, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyward Sword Blind Episode 2. In the last episode, we watched a bunch of cutscenes and got a little, very brief introduction to Link's new world. So, um, let's look around a little bit. Let's see what's through here. This is probably the way out. Yes, it is. It looks at that very shiny walkway out there. And, come on. There we go. Skyloft. Very nice. Music seems to have quite a Wind Waker feel to it. Hmm, this is quite interesting. What is this? Bird statue. Oh, you can save with these. Alright. So let's save my progress. Alrighty. And save. Okay. Let's see what other kind of stuff we got going on around here. Door! And we can't open it. Psh. Hmm. I can't mow the lawn yet because I don't have a sword. Ah, ah you can aim! Whoosh! Alrighty. Ooh, that's a big rupee. Run! Ha! Ah! Jeez, I can really run. Hey, Rosanic, up here! The people seem to look a lot. Did he just go like guh, like banjo? Today's finally the day of the long awaited wing ceremony. You feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Look this way while pressing and holding Z, then press A to have a quick chat with me. Sure, why not? Let's do it. Excellent! Always remember you can press Z to target something. Once you have targeted someone with Z, you can easily talk to him or her by pressing A. And even when there isn't anything to target, press Z is, pressing Z is a convenient way to f quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come join me up here? Psh, your face is silly. You should be able to climb if you dash on up top of that wooden box, don't you think? While moving, while moving, move while holding. There we go. A to dash, and you should be able to make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up here. Okay, so f we can't make that jump normally, apparently, but we should be able to. Whoa! Nice. Man, Link's got some new moves. <laughs> Woo! So what do you think? Using A to dash is useful, isn't it? However, don't dash around so much that you tire yourself out, or your stamina gauge will empty and you'll be completely out of breath. It's best to take a little break when your stamina gauge gets close to empty. Got all that? On to the next point. You can jump a short distance like this just by moving toward it. I like to call it the auto jump. Ah, yes, auto jump. It has a nice, uh, nice ring to it. Sure, there, buddy. Alright. And here we go. Okay, there's a little dialogue box above his head. I assume that means he has something interesting to say. So what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in this morning? Oh? You have someone to meet? Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, isn't she? Aww, uh -huh, you know it. Perfect timing, then. See, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gepora, has a pet named Mia, and, well, she scampered off again. Oh no! Look! Over there, do you see her? What is it, exactly? Headmaster's so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony is about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes, and well, you see. Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I'm on it. Ooh. Fantastic, so we'll do it? I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate you taking the time to help. Okay, so we need to find a way up there. You should be able to climb somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb up onto the roof from the other side. Terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. So certainly sounds like it for from. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. So in this game, you press A to do all your jumping stuff that you normally had to, that you would normally do just by walking into it. Okay. So you can swing the remote to kind of do a Tomb Raider esque, -esque dash, Majiggy. Hua. Alrighty, and up we go. A lot faster than he was in Twilight Princess, that's welcome. Okay, we have a crate, and... Whoop! Who's talking to me? I don't care how good a jumper you think you are, you'll never reach a roof that high just pressing A to dash. Okay, it's just gonna tell me to move the crate, blah blah blah. Wooden box, A, blah blah blah. And we move it over, alright. You know, some would say that this whole, um, stamina thing would make things kind of more, 
unnecessarily difficult, but, you know. <gasps> what are you? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, he's so cute! <laughs> he's so cute! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it's so freaking cute! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Up by the statue of the goddess. That was where Zelda was, I believe. So let's head on up there now. I believe Zelda's there with him, so you should hurry along. Okay, but before I do, I need to look at this little fuzzy thing. Whatever you are, you are adorable. <laughs> oh my god, it's like a mix of a lot of- it's still adorable, because it sounds like a kitten. <laughs> okay. This, I believe, is another save statue. There's quite a bit of these around. It's the second one I've been playing for like six minutes. Okay. What are you doing, buddy? Ooh. Ah! It's Waluigi! Morning, Rosanna. How's life? You managed to get even a wink of sleep last night? Figured you might have been tossing and turning all night thinking about the big ceremony today. What am I doing? Oh, just fixing this gate here. It's been squeaky lately and we can't have that on the day of the ceremony. Hopefully if Kami Kuba doesn't come and drop a block on it. You haven't already forgotten to send your prayers to the goddess this morning, have you? I don't do that, sir. Let's face the bird statue over there and say a short prayer to save your progress. So, okay, I guess I already do, did do that. Never mind. It's about time you get in the habit of stopping at a statue every time you run by one. <laughs> Prayer and time saves nine, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, no I don't. I got. I have no idea what that means. What are you? Whoop! A stamina fruit. Peel your fruit replenishes your stamina gauge. Oh. Oh, that's nifty. Let's go to my gear. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Okay, that's my wallet. Now I can't. Well, I'm not even standing on these stairs. They really should have. Okay, I like the way this game looks, but they really should have fixed that a little more. Although I noticed that they brought that they brought back the individual stepping, the individual steps positions that are majiggy from Wind Waker. That's welcome. It's a nice little addition. And here we go. Birdie. Hey, good morning, Rosanak. Glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. Is that what they're called? I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. Okay, you can hold A to speed up the text, because it's pretty slow here. Look at this instrument. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> wow, dude, you're really fascinated by that. The mind to use today at ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Or will you now? Okay. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one goddess was said to have in the legends. Of course. And it's probably gonna end up being the same one, because that's how things are in Zelda games. Oh well. Made to myself, and we'll get to use it in today's ceremony. Okay, between the harp and this outfit, I'm gonna make a great goddess today. Sure will, baby. I don't know. Got you up early this morning, because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Rosanic. Woo! How do I look? Ooh. <laughs> I think so, too. Oh my god, she's so adorable. <laughs> there you are, Zelda. You are prepared for today's ceremony. Hello, Father. Huh. This guy looks so much like Roru. It's crazy. There's no way that was accidental. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. Are all the heroes from Zelda games just incredibly lazy like me? That's pretty cool. 
No doubt today's ceremony has you too excited to close your eyes for once. He has huge eyes, dude. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda, so give your best out there. Really? I like where this is going. Yes, about that. Are you late? Damn it, not again. Oh, you don't know if I can do it. Recently, Rosanic hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. Hey, what? I have a lot of crap on my mind. I don't know what he's thinking. He's gonna give me perfect control of his bird to win today. I'm not gonna say it. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easy. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Rosanic and his Loftwing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. Okay, what kind of connection? I don't like those implications, sir. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our Loftwings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. So it's pretty much like the fairies for, Ko for the Kokiri. Alright. When we were young, every one of us meets our Loftwing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, but that first meeting between Rosanic and his Loftwing was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson Loftwing. It's a breed so rare we were sure from the time that it had vanished from that line. I probably read that wrong. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. <laughs> Do you recall when Rosanic and that Loftwing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy was hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging on how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. Haha, <laughs> you got told. Jeez, we're already up to 12 minutes. Link's lips are very pronounced in this game. It's kind of weird. Oh, what are you staring at, dude? Oh, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful bond shared by Rosanic and his bird. Anyone who's a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty look sooner or later. Ooh -hoo. This contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become Knights of Skyloft. Why would we need knights? Rosanic doesn't fly fast enough during the race. What if Rosanic messes up in his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? <laughs> Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. I should be given I should be doing some voices here. Honestly, it's almost as though you became a completely different person when you worry about Rosanic. Listen, Rosanak, you'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. I'll squeeze into a little something, but it's not going to be practice, if you know what I mean. Okay. Here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh, yeah? You can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Okay, this isn't a good idea. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rosanna, go ahead. Just press down the D-pad to call your loft wing. <laughs> you don't even have to do it. Oh, boy. That's not good. Hmm. This bird sure is taking a long time to get here. Something's wrong. Whoosh! Oh no! What will happen to us? No! Hang in there, Zanuck. I've got you! Oh, okay. Well, that was a really short cliffhanger. <laughs> Alrighty, so, uh, seems we're okay. You two alright? Of course I'm fine. Okay, I'll see you guys next time for episode 3 of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword Blind. See you guys then.